Hello there. Um, this is Okanya Soraj, um, a digital marketing manager, an author, and uh, um, a tutor uh, on Triply and a super prof. I've been teaching mathematics for more than 19 years with a great experience, many have learned and got good grades uh, from my lessons, and I would like to take it at another level. If you subscribe to my channel, you'll get many free lessons, and I'll be giving out a free book you can get via the email um, for those who will answer my questions I'll leave behind well. Um, this is our very first lesson, and it's going to be on uh, number systems. After this lesson, uh, you will gain um, thorough understanding of the concept of numbers and how we apply numbers to solve common problems. Uh, getting skills in the topics like number, meanings, types, and examples Factors, multiples, divisibility tests, um, number bases, and um, how we can apply that to the abacus. Then also how we can use the, the place values of the abacus. Um, we shall also look at the number system, um, how we can use it on the number line. Fractions, decimals, percentages, integers, algebra, and then we shall also talk about data. Um, in our detailed discussion, you can also get uh, some few uh, notes if you want them on this idea um, of the number system. I've put them on my whiteboard. I hope you can see them very well there, uh, you can uh, see basically what I've been talking about. And then basically we can also make a detail of um, our discussion. We look at uh, uh, a number, a symbol we use in counting, and the following are examples of the, the numerals. We have what we call the a Roman numerals, I hope you can see them very well on my white uh, chart there. The Arabic numerals, uh, how they are written. Then you can also have what we call the types of numbers. Uh, Hindu Arabic numerals are the ones you with. The types of numbers we have, we have the even numbers, um, we have the even numbers are the numbers that when divided by two, you don't get a remainder. Then the odd numbers are numbers that when we divide by two, you get a remainder of one. So I've given some good examples as you can see here. Um, hope members can see them very well. Or I can bring my camera closer. Oh, it is okay, leave it as it is. Um, so, the, you can also look at the counting numbers. These are the numbers you've been looking at from our nursery onwards. Uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, up to on. The, end, the list is endless. The natural numbers are the numbers that are counting numbers excluding 0. Then, all numbers are all the counting numbers. Square numbers are the numbers uh, we get by multiplying a number by itself. As I've illustrated here, um, these are some of the ones you can see. Triangular numbers are the numbers you get by adding our counting numbers. When you add the counting numbers as I've illustrated uh, here, when you add the counting numbers, you get the the tangent numbers, like you have 1, 3, 6, 10, 15, 
21, uh, 28, 36. Then we have the prime numbers and numbers which have only two factors, one and itself. That will give an example 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13. And then composite numbers are numbers with more than two factors. Uh, that means it's the opposite of the prime numbers. So I've illustrated 4, 6, 8, 9, 12. And then consecutive numbers and numbers following each other. So I hope you've got something in this lesson. We shall be having more and more in the next lesson. Thank you very much. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And you can also get more from my website that I've put in the description. Thank you very much.